my YouTube got hacked. Anyways, um, yeah, my YouTube got hacked over the last week, and here is the timeline for that. Hey fam, I hope you guys are doing pretty well. As you guys can see, not so much on this end, just because there's been, it's been a tough week. It's, it's been quite a rough week, personally, and in this video i would like to touch up on how my youtube got hacked and like kind of like the timeline of from being hacked to recovering it as you guys can see i got my little baby back and we are now up and rolling again i don't know if i'm comfortable making content at the moment even though my my backdrop setup is kind of like unavailable right now at the moment it is holiday season so like everything has gone against me on making content but i promise you i'll try to upload at least twice this month so yeah with that being said Said, let's get right into the video and this is how i lost my channel in minutes all right so this video is going to be really chatty so if you do have some snacks nearby go ahead and grab it sit down relax and listen to me rant for like a little bit is that dust? so it all started last monday like whenever i'm recording this it is december the 5th I woke up just like any other morning i felt great i felt fine probably a little itchy but i woke up and the first thing i do whenever i wake up is check my phone probably not the best thing in the world to check your phone whenever you first wake up quite unhealthy if you ask me but i did it anyways because you know i am human um yeah no my phone was not turning on and i as you guys can see here, I do have the new iPhone Pro Max. It's fairly new. I've only had this for like a month or so. Um, the screen wasn't turning on and I was like freaking out. So that woke me up. I jumped into my computer. I was like searching everything I could do to fix it. So there's a new thing called the black screen of death, which means your iPhone does not turn on. It does not charge. It does not do anything. You just have to like kind of like hard reset the phone that took me an hour keep in mind i do wake up really early so this is around like five o'clock in the morning that took an hour so it was like 6 30 6 40 uh whenever i initially fixed the phone i then go into my gmail and just to see what's going on i usually check my gmail and my youtube studios right in the morning yeah so i checked my gmail and i saw this email popped up google accounts and the, the location that it was sending from was drive dash shares dash no reply at google.com so i thought it was an actual google account so i do not have the exact email that they sent because i do not want to get scammed again okay i do however have like a screenshot of what it looks like via other people that experience this type of scam before so i'm just gonna read it from my computer here if you guys don't mind it is all right so under the under the email that they sent there is an attachment to like this like piece of paper like virtual paper thingy that looks like it was sent from youtube it had the youtube logo and it had like everything that you thought it would be official you know and the title was copyright infringement warning it basically says that this video that you have on your channel manually reviewed by somebody and they decide to copyright strike your video there's a portion of the page that listed the video that is going under review for the copyright and the link all of which is accurate like that is my video i can paste the link and like it would go into the video everything was accurate but the bottom says to view full report and make sure the document is accurate or that you want to like appeal it you have to click on the full document me as a content creator i am super super scared of getting any type of copyright strikes or any type of like copyright infringement kind of like deal i'm super critical of that and i'm super scared to have one like i can't even imagine having a copyright strike on my channel because everything i film is just my own footage unless there's other footage that i ask other people to share so i clicked on the full document and since i use like an idm on my computer so like it just is like a middleman to like download a certain file on my computer i download it because i thought it was an actual file you know like it does that a lot and then it sends me to the zip folder that i have to extract another file that has the that has something that looks like a like a word document like the dot d o c x whenever i clicked on it 
nothing happened so right then and there i thought it was a scam i immediately deleted it i immediately went to my like kind of computer system and kind of like delete everything free up every disk space i know so i just deleted everything on site and i thought i was quick to act and just keep in mind by the time of this happening i already have like two-step verification on a recovery email a phone number and like everything in the book later later that morning it happened really fast actually i was checking my stats i was checking like my subscriber count and like kind of like my stats on my youtube and all that stuff not important but i don't know where i was logged out of my youtube i thought it was weird because you know like i'm already signed in why would i be logged out and then i get four emails from my uh recovery account like my recovery personal email i, I got one that says uh i just changed my password to my youtube email i just changed the recovery email and then i encrypted a security key into the email which basically just gave me the biggest middle finger up of recovering the email by myself because like the security key is a physical key that you have to plug into your computer in order to kind of like access the account or like ask access something that has like a password it's basically just like a like a straight up just like a lock so i tried for six hours i think it was like already evening whenever i stopped trying like i tried everything i can like i literally tried to look up on reddit look up on youtube do every single thing even like i did function 12 whatever that helps you know like nothing worked literally nothing worked and i was at the time you know like you could have think like everything from the past five years i've been working towards has been gone in just a split second so i was panicking at the same time so which did not help my case at all in terms of like how i could have handled it whenever those things happen it's just super scary to even like comprehend you know and then like whenever i finally gave up like i felt so defeated i felt like my life has fallen apart like the past five years all the good memories that i made on this channel are gone everything is gone my community tab is gone i can't access to it i only have a little bit of my videos that i haven't privated yet still on the channel and that's the videos that are still watchable right now i even go as far as to kind of like talk to like an it service but they were charging humongous dollars humongous dollars to even recover an account they said that they couldn't like release the hold or like they couldn't do anything about recovering my my account because there was a security key on it so at that point forward like i just lost all hope i just did not want to deal with anything anymore i made a new account it's still called Jacob Lee and with a new Gmail account and I was planning to upload just like my my older content on there for the time being until I start making content again. I reached out to everybody on Instagram asking if they know anybody who has the sort of skills to kind of like recover my account. Nada, nothing, zilch. Yeah, in this period in time, kind of lost my mind a little bit. I literally asked my girlfriend to come over to just like kind of distract me, you know? made like a new account just update everybody on the whole situation and then the next day hits and the next day the next day i woke up december 6th i checked to see if my channel was still there yes it was everything was still there and at this point in time i thought why would i would the hacker hack my account if he's not gonna go through my youtube delete everything right it seems like everybody who got hacked in the past always have an experience like their channel being deleted or they have like suspicious upload onto the channel in like a minimum of, like 24 hours so it's been like over a day so i thought it was really weird because why hack my account whenever you're not going to use my youtube like you hacked it using a youtube kind of problem so why why would you, why would you do that you know then I go throughout my day later on. Keep in mind, every single morning, I tried to attempt to log into my account, hoping that they would just delete the security key or they would just take it off so I can just go in there and do it fast. After a couple of account recovery attempts, which Google, that shit don't help. That shit does not help. But yeah, after a while, it says too many failed attempts. 
and they're basically gonna just like block my account or like just lock it you know so i was pretty much just sad i just can't get my thing back and i've looked everywhere on the forums reddit instagram youtube facebook even like i don't have a successful twitter so i can't message team youtube from there so i did what i had to do and i just kind of like take it in accept it and i move forward later that day though one of my followers on instagram told me that i am live on youtube i am live on youtube why would i be live on youtube if i don't even have my account obviously it's a scammer so i was like oh the scammer has gone out of his way or her way to upload something and it's, it was a live and it is titled elon musk talk about ftx collapse the future of cryptocurrency slash bitcoin ethereum and doge take lead what the fuck what is that even supposed to mean i'm a fucking fashion channel so explain so they had posted out live with my name under it like totally totally tarnished the image of my channel right then and there because i do not want to have anything to do with anything re regarding crypto first of all but yeah no at the time of this my youtube is still there like my name and all that stuff my videos are still there and we'll just forward it to the next day the next day like just the reality hit me and i'm kind of like just like i'm just over losing my youtube channel so i'm like all right you know what it's lost i can i can build it back up whatever the fuck and then and then i check youtube like with my new account i didn't subscribe to my old one at all so i usually just use it by the search engine so i search up jacob lee usually i would be the first one there you know normal stuff i search up jacob lee a mysterious mysterious account came up not even my name but it has my sub subscriber count you know like i still remember that um it's called tesla Inc. What? Tesla Inc. They changed my whole YouTube channel. Something that is about Tesla. So according, technically, so technically, I own a little bit of the Tesla social media. I don't know. But no, they changed everything to Tesla Inc. But the the at was still Jacob Dot. You know, like that, that was my, like my at since they like introduced the YouTube handle service thing. But whenever you click on Tesla Inc. or my channel, it says the app was booming 190. I don't even know what that means. Like I'm super oblivious. I don't I honestly do not know what that means. So I just I was just defeated. I looked at my social blade, everything was going downhill. I lost like 15k views that day. Like it was and during that, like the channel went live again. So I don't have a recording of the live, but literally, like every time they went live, it's just very generic background, colorful background with a clock and they were live for hours like they were live for three hours garnishing like 2k views for some reason i don't know why why did they bring all that traction into my account like it's it's not even alive like there was no talking there was no elon musk there was no crypto there was nothing there was just like a fucking screen with a clock so i was like what the hell you know like i was so done and then i saw a post on the google community kind of like page and one of them was saying that like if you want external help from like a like an expert on the subject it's kind of like post a statement on the community page so that's what i did i wrote out the best essay i could configure i wrote out the best the best essay i could make up you know oh i didn't make it up because it's all from experience but like it was like at least seven pages long so i didn't get a response from the first 24 hours but the next day on december 8th I think my timeline is kind of messed up, but still. Anyways, they had they had responded to me, and they were like, "We're gonna transfer you to the YouTube support team instead." And the YouTube support team was like, "All right, we're just, we know that you are who you are. Like, you can give us like I gave them like my AdSense number, you know, like I give them everything. So they're like, "All right, we believe you. So we're gonna start doing the recovery stage, and we're gonna recover your account." Nothing really happened until the later evening, where I saw your account has been terminated for violation 
violating YouTube community guidelines. In my head, I didn't know if like the people from the YouTube support team terminated it just because they want to recover it or if it got terminated through the guideline system, through the algorithm, just doesn't like cryptocurrency for some reason. Me looking at that, I was super shocked. Like, I didn't know what to do. Like that's, it's all gone now. Almost later that night, uh, the like later on to that night, I got a, a message from the Google support team telling me to fill out some documents, just kind of like verifying what happened, how it happened, and like kind of like my identity almost. After I filled out the documents, it took like a while to get them into the YouTube kind of like office. Forward to the next morning, I got a message from YouTube that they're gonna start um, recovering my account now on December 9th nothing really much happened because they were recovering it for the last day or so uh then they sent me a link to kind of recover my account right now and i went in there i changed it to a new password everything was going smoothly so basically you have to recover the gmail first before you recover the youtube so i got my gmail re recovered absolutely the a big w on my side like just just a really big w on my part because you know like the gmail is like everything to me you know like that's where i get my brand collaboration oh yeah keep in mind like during this point in time i told my brands i was like oh, dude i literally lost my channel i'm sorry but if there's any other way i can continue our partnership black taylor thank you so much for being so cool about it like the big shout out to you guys you guys are so nice to me all the damn time and i promise i'll get that video up soon but yeah got my got my gmail back and everything was looking smoothly or everything was looking smooth like there's a glimmer of hope and then i got a message from gmail uh they said that they're recovering the channel right now and everything should be fine in a couple of days and then on december 10th i woke up and my channel is there with the tesla ink kind of like thing like they didn't change anything they just recovered it so i asked them if it's okay if they're finished so i can like go in and kind of like change it back to how it was i said yeah it was okay like everything is good now it's just make sure that like every like step up identification every backup everything is still on and make sure that like i secure like kind of like my youtube and like my gmail from now on even though not like i haven't it's it just wasn't good and every hacker is like improving by the day or whatever that is how i got my channel back and i just go in there change it to like everything going back there um something that i am still confused about is that like whenever my videos are privated uh, i change them back to um to normal and for some reason um my channel lost a lot of the comments from older videos so if you guys don't see your comments on older videos youtube said it might take a a little bit to have them back but it's been like 48 hours and i haven't had them back yet so i'm just a little worried that i might lose my my comments but still at the same time like i'd rather lose my comment than the whole channel you know but yeah that is how i got my channel back so if you guys have a youtube account please please do not make the mistake i did by uh opening the document on the youtube infringement scam anytime you guys see a very official document from something that you really care about but it also looks sus at the same time like i know in the back of my head that i did not do anything to revoke the copyright policies anything not even the like the tos uh, guidelines so i know for a fact i didn't do anything i thought it was just a false claim that's why i clicked on it i was panicking but this is the moral of the story is that do not click on anything that you don't trust in your gut just do some like minor do some minor research like if there's no videos or there's no like tiktoks around that area just wait for a couple of days because i'm pretty sure millions and millions of people are getting scammed left and right just take it from me that just every time you find something suspicious on like anything online and kind of like think about it for a little bit and just don't act on it just yet everybody has time to wait on you you're not losing anything by just waiting like a day or two and risk of being scammed and losing your channel losing your whole job essentially but yeah that was my experience of losing my channel and now let's go on to the updates and my future plans i know this has been the longest video i did not intended to make this video that long but still um 
so my plans going forward to the channel is that obviously I am going to keep uploading on this channel. This is like literally my well-being. Uh, this is everything that I've been working for for the last five years, and I've finally gotten somewhere with it. I'm not gonna stop now. Like I know I'm taking a break just because like the last week has been super, super mind-boggling personally so yeah i'm just taking like just a little break from last week and the first video that's going to be up is going to be a video regarding black taylor and our collab together so really excited to do that and uh that's just future updates like nothing will be changing on the channel i'm still going to make content on here the new channel is up and i don't have a link for it yet i still want to do some stuff on the new channel like i want to experiment a little bit maybe make that a vlog channel maybe just do some extra content or like experimental content on there whenever i do have time but for right now i don't know what i'm going to do yet but it's still going to be open like there's there's one video on there just that just addressed my first day of experiencing the the hack of my account that's pretty interesting in my opinion right the channel is going to be the right there and i might upload in the future i might not on there but as far as you guys are concerned are this channel will still be intact so be active and i will upload almost every week and then finally i do want to take this time this last portion of the video to just to thank every single one of you guys for your tremendous support on the channel even the ones who hit me up on instagram updating me about the like the status of my channel like you guys are very very appreciated over here it's just been a great experience to just have a lot of support members that like cares a lot about the channel and like a lot about the content that i make it's just super nice just to have that and i honestly am so grateful to even have the chance to have an audience so yeah thank you so much guys and i literally wouldn't be here without you guys so that is gonna be it no corny moments on the channel but yeah that is going to be it for today's video if you guys like this video please drop a like don't even dislike the video i usually tell you guys to dislike the video if you guys don't like it but like the video so that my channel can kind of like go back to its old kind of like stats you know what i mean probably cheating in the system but please if you do have any sympathy on me just like the video yeah comment below what you guys think about the new channel give me ideas on what i should upload on the new channel i'm super excited to start this whole youtube journey back up again just remember that it's literally about the journey not about the destination all right stop myself from rambling even more making the video longer i'm just gonna leave you guys now thank you so much for watching the video today and thank you so much for supporting me throughout the years no matter if you're old no matter if you're young or no matter if you've been with the channel for a while no matter if you're just subscribed like yesterday thank you so much for being here i really really do appreciate everything that all you guys do for me i am gonna head out now peace out guys